What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily. Let's get into the tech news. We only have one story today. Very slow news day and I need to get my news video kind of quick today because I don't have a lot of time. I'm busy going to a party later on and uh, I wanted to talk about a little kind of a walkthrough, a tidbit, a trick for YouTube. YouTube has recently changed their app that when you do watch a video, let me put one of my videos on because I do all my videos in 4K. So when the video's playing, it used to be pretty easy to change the resolution of the video up to 1080p or 4K or whatever the max resolution is of the phone. Well, they changed it. So usually you would tap the screen, hit the three dots, and you would see quality. And hey, that's still there, great. But when you hit quality, now you have this new menu to choose from, auto, high picture quality, data saver, or advanced. And I think when a lot of people see advanced, they're gonna get scared. They're gonna be like, oh, I don't wanna go in there. Don't know what that means. So I think a lot of people will just choose auto recommended, thinking that they're always gonna get the very best resolution that's offered from YouTube, no matter what connection they're on. Have it be a really slow one, a really fast one, that it would always play you know, the best uh, quality resolution. Well, that's not gonna probably always be the case. You also might just do high, higher picture quality, and that ultimately might only do, let's see what that puts that into. That's gonna put that into, it still puts it into 1440p, which is great, but what if you wanna go to 2160 or something, maybe it only does 1080p, whatever it is. Hit those three dots again, we go back in there. What you wanna do, quality, you wanna choose advanced. As scary as the word advanced is, don't be scared. That's where you have to go. So you tap advanced, and then from here you get that same menu probably used to going into to watch the highest quality video. Now, it obviously goes in from the best all the way down to the worst. If I were you, I would always watch it in at least 1080p if, if it's available. But you know what, why not watch it in 2K or 4K resolution if the creator that posts the video offers it. I, you know, when I do it, I always have, if I, especially on the computer at the very least, because I have that huge display, I always watch it in 4K or 8K. Uh, with phones, I've noticed that uh, you can only choose it in uh, 4K, at least I, I from the, the Galaxy side. I'm not even though, I don't, I don't think, yeah, because I had an 8K video, it wouldn't let me play that in 8K, it would only let me do in 4K. But that's how you're gonna play the max resolution video on your phone. If you're on the iPhone side, tap the screen, hit the three dots, choose quality. They still have the same love, loved menu to change the resolution. I don't know why Android changed it, but Apple app hasn't yet, at least from what I've seen. So you'll still just be able to choose the top one and play it in 4K resolution. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. New videos every single day. My question now to you is, what do you watch your resolution of your videos in on your phone or even on your computer? Let me know. Like I said, 4K always or 8K on my computer. On my phones and stuff, it's usually 4K if I remember. Otherwise, it's like 1080 or 2K. We'll see you guys down the road. Peace.